Hello everyone, Hector Mendoza. I am going to show you how you can rotate uh, text, shapes, and image in vector. So there's two ways of doing it. You can manually do it or you can use it keying in uh, the numbers under the rotation uh, dialog box. So let me show you. Um, so, so I have a, a, a shape here, okay, and I wanted to, let's say if I wanted to rotate this, there's two ways of doing it. One of them, uh, it's a, a little hard, I, yeah, I'm having problems doing it. Uh, there might be an easier way, maybe I'm missing something out of this, but if I go in here and hover, around this shape you see right there did you see that little it right there see right there that is a rotation uh, key uh, tool once you see that appear and you left click then you can rotate it manually and then if you go in and hold the shift key, it'll rotate at 22.5 degrees, okay? And if I let go of the shift key, then you can rotate it any way you want. And uh, so the way that I, you find that little rotate, rotating um, tool is you cover right here and then you you just go to the, I guess at a 45 degree angle from this area you just keep on going you see that you just keep on going to the left and it rotates you go right here you mo move over to the right and then you see that box and that will allow you to rotate now I have was having a problem doing that at the beginning so let's say that you don't want to hassle with that and you want to go ahead and rotate this mathematically now if you don't understand about rotating degrees basically you know you have your 0 45 90 and uh, you know 180 your 225 and 270 270 and 315 degrees that normally are uh, rotations at a 22.5 degree rotation. So let me let me show you what I'm talking about. So this is basically what I'm talking about right here, right? Each one of them have a different degree. Now, even though this is at th 33. Uh, 337.5 degrees from from my original rotation it's actually minus 22.49999 degrees okay so you can do it either way it's a uh, it would so those two you can use a minus or a positive degree in rotating things Okay, so let me let me show you on on, on a box first or a, a shape. Let's go ahead and turn off the layers. Okay, so hey, let me turn that into a zero uh, rotation. So right now, at the axis of zero zero uh, rotation, if I click on here, first look. If I deselect, you don't see nothing here, right? But if you click here, you get additional uh, things that you can do to your boxes. Now, if you come all the way to the right bottom corner, you see this thing that, that says rotate. You can click on this up and down arrow and rotate it at one degree at a time. Or you can select and rotate it like 22.5 degrees okay and then 
you can click this way or you can select it and hit 45 degrees okay so that's probably one of the easiest way to do this um, and, and personally I use a lot of degrees I don't manually uh, rotate things I I usually use mathematical equations to rotate that way I get uh, uniform uh, um, what is it called uniformity so you can do the same thing with text okay so if you have a, a text and right there is at zero degrees okay so I'm gonna hit control C control V and the, the first one I'm gonna do I'm gonna rotate it at 22 point oops 22.5 degrees okay so the way I created what you see up there then I would I went in and hit control C control V and this one instead of 22.5 degree I uh, you add another 22.5 degree and that that equates to 45 degree so I did that until I had a circle that looked like that okay so you know so we had 0 22.5 45 65.5 90 degrees 112.5 135 157.5 and so forth and I was able to create this effect and so that's text these are shapes and then I did the same thing with this image it, this image is at zero degree this one is at 22 even though it says uh, yeah, it's, yeah, it does say 22.5, and then this one said 44.999. When I did this, I told it 45 degree. I guess the uh, the program decided to put whatever it wanted there, which was close. It was just point zero 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 of a percent. But anyway, that's all I wanted to show you on this video. I um. I had a I was showing a video and I I was having difficulties in doing a rotation and getting that uh, that little icon to show up. Now I, I think I figured it out. You just keep on going to the right until you see it. Okay, and same thing up here. You just go straight up and then it eventually it'll turn into uh, here. Let's start from the bottom because there's something there. So you once you see that. Uh, arrow you just go straight down until you hit see that uh, rotation key okay same thing here watch I'm just going to the left and then all of a sudden it rotates so now you know uh, I'm learning this program so it's uh, it's pretty cool anyway thank you for watching my video I hope you enjoyed this I will see you on the next video